can you just talk a little bit um, more about the findings of the Thales trial? What did the findings specifically add to the body of evidence that we already know about Ticka Greller, um, considering Ticka Greller's long history um, as an FDA approved uh, drug? Uh, yeah, the Thales uh, trial demonstrated that Berlinta 90 milligrams per aspirin significantly reduced the risk of stroke or death at 30 days, right, compared to aspirin alone in patients with acute ischemic stroke as well as those with high risk uh, TIA. The results from the trial itself add to the extensive and robust body of evidence and benefits we've seen with the Berlinta in patients in the past who have had a high risk of thromboembolic or arthrothrombotic events, right? Uh, the findings from the Thales study demonstrate that the efficacy of Berlinta for secondary prevention of stroke or death in patients who have experienced AIS or TIA and builds on Berlinta's established heritage in uh, the treatment of patients with high-risk ischemic events, such as uh, the ones that we had following uh, our label indication that we got for Plato, Pegasus, which was uh, TIMI-54, and of course, the Themis study, which we just uh, recently got uh, an indication for earlier uh, this year. Um, can you talk a little bit more about what makes Ticagrella or Berlinta um, stand out in comparison to some of the other agents that, ha that may reduce uh, recurrent stroke? I think what we know is in spite of the available treatments, there remains a substantial unmet clinical need in addressing uh, prevention of these catastrophic uh, secondary events. We know that for sure, right? We know, we know the numbers. Uh, the results of, I believe, the Thales uh, trial adds to the scientific uh, evidence base of the efficacy and safety of dual antiplatelet therapy, that's DAP, mm -hmm. and further supports implementation of DAP reg regimen for secondary prevention of stroke or TIA in this patient population. I mean, given the high prevalence of recurrent strokes, uh, these studies provide physicians with a better understanding of the burden of illness and possible options to manage patients' risks because we know it is devastating as a disease state.